still look we're still in one piece with this little one but everything is absolutely fabulous I cannot complain everything is just lovely so thank you for your best wishes I so love recording for you and I when when the video is happening like this project where it's like a pure magic happening right in front of your eyes and my eyes this is the best thing ever I hope you feel the same about this piece so simple I promise you, you can do it. So do it, do it, do it once more. Just do it! <laughs> Let's break a blank page with the watercolors. Let's do some uh, experiments, some testing, some exercise with watercolors. And especially for those who are worried and stressed about how to watercolor, we will do something super simple today. I am going to actually use a masking fluid, but not necessarily, you don't have to have it. I've used it here on this page already. Masking fluid is this liquid that will resist after drying, and that will resist your paint basically. And so what I did is I just sprinkled a few dots of the masking fluid here on my paper and this will dry and we can come back to it. When it dries you can paint over it and when everything dries you can just rub it off the liquid, the, the masking fluid and it should leave you blank spaces. So that's how it looks. Let me show you. Uh, we will do this with the watercolor <coughs> fluid, a masking fluid and without it. And how are we going to break our page today guys? How what would you like to do? I have this uh, vision of abstract of something that is very much um, like means not much. <laughs> you know I love circles. This is one of the probably easiest options uh, to do. So I suggest you to just paint some circles. Let's paint some circles together. Uh, they don't have to be uh, precise. If you like they can. So it's really up to up to you. And I'm not really either trying here for any sort of techniques. No. Grab your watercolors, any watercolors you have, and just enjoy the beauty of painting without really, uh, you know, without really stressing over the final look. So that's what I'm uh, doing right now. And, you know, just random uh, watercolor circles. That's kind of what I see. We do abstract, abstract painting for everyone. So if you're starting with your watercolor journey, that's good. If you're more experienced and you find it inspirational, that's even better. Go for it. <laughs> and I'm just playing with colors and water and just trying to be kind of not precise, no, not much, no. And I have do you remember when we've done this flowers uh, with the sprinkle uh, water where we sprinkled and dripped down the, you know, with the flowers kind of thing? There is this video. Um, I cannot find the actual um, the actual project <laughs> now, uh, but it will be kind of similar idea. I think it would be nice, so we can do something like that. A little bit of abstract in there with the sprinkled water. That's what we will do maybe. So I'm just adding really randomly, really, really randomly. And I'm not even covering everything uh, with paint. And now I'm going to sprinkle uh, this. And if it's too much, that's okay. I don't mind if my circle is off, off the shape. And now what I will do is I wish for it to kind of make this nice drippage effect <clears throat> which I totally love I love 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 that and I'm gonna try to dry this and come back to you and we will do some second uh, layer of painting so this is dry right now and I think it's uh, a great way to add another layer maybe of a different color or maybe a different shape or just darker or whichever you like I love how the sprinkle spraying with water made this not so even. Uh, I just think it's very pretty and very nice and artistic and also very, I would say, um, very uh, what's the word? Abstract. Abstract. Yes. Now, another thing that could be nice to be done is maybe do uh, some splashes. So the color of this circle goes together 
kind of-ish with the rest of the picture, let's say, and, <clears throat> you know, just, just random things, random, um, well, that's a nice color I have here, which maybe could be add could be added here even mm -hmm. maybe even darker so it's nice that you can you know work your magic with the layers now and you have different sort of uh, <clears throat> transparency layers so it's just something nice and different and again sprinkle with your same color maybe and <clears throat> what else I have here that could match this color is nice I could make this nice here mm -hmm. I love that I love that <clears throat> what else Will we go for some pink just to have the kind of balance or off balance however you want to call it <laughs> but maybe just would be nice to see how things could be if if it's you know <laughs> do I have any other nice pink here maybe here <clears throat> it will kind of break the whole idea of blue maybe I don't know uh, as you can tell I'm not precise here I'm not rushing I'm not concentrating on any kind of um, on any sort of um, shape size no I'm enjoying pure uh, satisfaction of creating something that is just nice and abstract and different so I like that I love that mm -hmm. that's so nice and you can tell I'm dirtying each other's circles kind of which is okay because we can do that you know we can pink now a little bit more or this pink maybe now you'll be asking me for the brands of paints again this is Jane Davenport those are Soho paints but any watercolors you have will do the same sort of job unless you really wish for something different that I don't know but use what you have oh look at that nice uh, <laughs> mixture and now I think I'm just gonna go for the this effect of uh, spillage sprinkleage that's a lot of ah that's a lot of water if not too much to be honest but it's okay now I wish my paint this one goes directly down there not not to not on top of the not on this circle but on the actual here yes I would like that if I can have a word to say maybe I just help it yeah oh that's very abstractish now <laughs> but I love that okay let me just clean that before okay super now if you feel that mm, I'm losing my shape or something that's okay just you can just add it more color or something just play with it a, a little more maybe if you wish or you know after drawing things always looks they always look different so that's okay as well that's nice as well I like that I'm gonna draw this and as always come back to you in just a few minutes this one is pretty much dry and same for this one um, I'm gonna try and just paint a little bit uh, on top of my yeah that's that that seems to be dry and paint on top of my um, masking fluid mm -hmm. because and spray some water you can see that it's water resist so it does not cover where the spots are of the masking fluid so that should stay white basically I hope it will <laughs> and one more oops my masking fluid was not 
fully dry in this piece, in this place, that's okay. That's really fine. Mm -hmm. So we just play around without much of a thought given to it and just just really enjoying it. <laughs> Maybe a bit more water. That's nice. That's nice. Maybe a bit too big to my liking, but that's okay. That's okay. <clears throat> that's really fine. It's like a volcano nearly with the holes on the of the white. <laughs> that's nice. Okay, super. Oh, that's nice. Okay, I need this to dry. So I leave that for drying and I'm going to come back to this one now uh, and I'm going to show you my previous project. I found it. <laughs> Do you remember this one, this video? So many of you liked it, loved it completely and such a simple project to make. So uh, this is where we have done circles and sprinkle with water and drippage so that's kind of more of an abstract these were like flowers <laughs> but this is abstract more free more kind of loose and let go in the in the making so I think I prefer this version but again it's really up to yourself what else could we do we could do some more splashes we could do some draw, dr drawings and what I think we should a better idea maybe <laughs> something different I have this old stamp from Prima I have seen this on eBay as well, the stitching stamp, so have a look around, but this is the old one, this is the very old uh, stamp, but I know I've seen them around somewhere online, because Prima doesn't carry them anymore, uh, so what I will do, I think what, I, well, what we will do is we will try to stamp some circles on top of our page and I think it will be awesome I hope so <laughs> now if you don't have a stamp you can just make a doodle and draw it and that will be fine as well so no mm, I love that now it's not even about being so precise it's more <laughs> you know try to let go loose up loosen up a little bit <clears throat> super I love that I'm gonna repeat that pattern turn around my turn around my my uh, stamp and just be kind of off so it will be darker lovely Lovely jovely, lovely job. Now I'm doing something like this here, maybe here as well, and we have a smaller size. Wow, how not, how, why not, how come you, you no. What's the word? How to not love it. <laughs> How to not love that. Now, random. Um, b -b 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 <gasps> Where? Here. 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 And it's like nearly finished. I mean, it, it could be easily finished, isn't it? Now I'm gonna take my elegant writer and I'm gonna just go kind of randomly around my stitched uh, st stitched um, stamp and why? It's because this reacts with water nicely. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just sprinkle with water my elegant writer pen. Now, if you don't have an elegant writer, 
use some other pens that are not permanent and sp spray it with water and see what happens. Where's my water? Okay. You see? Can you see the kind of movement it makes? Not only it reacts with the um, with the pen itself, but also with the water, with the watercolor. So you get kind of a better idea of even a better idea of how color can mix nicely and differently and just I love that effect okay mm -hmm. ah, can you see Oops. the flow here and there it's just nice <laughs> elegant right there ah, look at that no I think, you know, we don't want this to go too much, too crazy, but I think it's just awesome. <laughs> and you have to try it. You have to trust me, isn't it? You will. Just absolutely love it. Loved it. Love it. Promise, 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 promise. <clears throat> oh, magic. <laughs> if anyone will ask, elegant writer. I have some others here. Elegant writer. Elegant writer. And what about if we just gently do like this? Like, really, that's it. That's it. Not much. This is sensational. I'm sorry, but it is. Let's dry this. Oh, I'll show you this. It's nearly dry. We come back to it in two seconds. Just two seconds. And, and what do you think? Because I think it's just... Wow. I love that. I'm going to be definitely doing more of them kinds. I love it, love it, love it. I'm going to add some stickers as my titles. I have four sets of stickers. Uh, small words, small messages, small sayings, small whispers. So, word inspire is just so perfect to add. Those are transparent stickers, my stickers. <laughs> if anyone is asking, uh, you can get them in my Etsy store. Now, I'm gonna add it somewhere there. Now, to make this look better, because you may feel it's grayish or something, use your use this so that way it's it disappears more or less it's just less visible the the sticker itself so that's a nice tip and trick if i know that so many of you is already having those stickers so inspire um explore would be good now you can write your own sentences you don't have to use stickers, oh god no, so you can do whatever you want. And explore maybe here is nice. Creativity is you. Painted silence. <laughs> Painted silence, that's nice, I like that. Maybe here. <clears throat> Listen to your heart and just create, guys. And just create. Mm. Hmm. Why not? Why not to create? Tell me. Why not? You have your watercolors. You have your time in hand. Have you got some brushes? I'm sure you have some brushes. You have to have some brushes. Don't give up. Just do it. See where this will take you. Now. Don't give up. Ever. Ever. And follow your heart. <clears throat> and follow your heart. I love that. I so much love that. Ah, awesome. I think I can call it down, except we need some white splashes. I have some white acrylics here. You can use white gesso, you can use whatever you 
fancy to make your beautiful white splashes. I think white splashes always works, but no, it's just a matter of preferences, what you like, what you feel works best for you. Now, as always, if you make a, vi uh, a project inspired by this one, let me know, please tag me. Use hashtag MaremiSmallArt so I can come to your Instagram and have a look and see and be inspired. Um, same, you can post it on my Facebook page or you can message me, email me. Um, I would love to hear from you and <laughs> most definitely let me know, as always, what you think. Leaving a comment is a must. No, just kidding, it's not. <laughs> Okay, I'm still in one piece as you can tell, still, look, we're still in one piece with this little one, but everything is absolutely fabulous, I cannot complain, everything is just lovely, so thank you for your best wishes, I think we can, he I think she can hear them, she she really does hear your best wishes, uh, like me, and I love reading your amazing, amazing supportive comments, like, this is the best thing ever. So thank you for, for, for that. Um, I don't know how many more videos <laughs> you will see, how how much longer we're gonna be in one piece, but everything is absolutely uh, perfect, really good, really, really, really good. I'm so excited. I'm getting excited. I was nervous uh, most of the time the last few weeks, but now I'm, <laughs> I'm at the stage of being really excited. So yes, I'm gonna finish here my friends uh, the 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 roundy bump is very into theme with those circles so it matches I should make a photo like, like this I'm gonna thank you so much for being around with me I so love recording for you and I when when the video is happening like this project where it's like a pure magic happening right in front of your eyes and my eyes this is the best think ever. I hope you feel the same about this piece. So simple. Pro I promise you, you can do it. So do it, do it, do it once more. Just do it. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, if you wish to have a look at the stickers, they're in my Etsy store, Marimi Small Art. So have a look. And I give you a link below the video and at the end of the video. Yes. And of course, one huge favor to ask you all to share this video with your friends on your social media uh, so more people can see it. I hope you are inspired, so grab your paints, grab your brushes and do some art. Please do. You will just have a good time with it, I promise. Um, yeah, <laughs> that's enough. Enough! Bye bye! I love you and till the next time, bye bye! P.S. This one I'll finish on the next video, so stay tuned for this one as well. Bye!